Of the three molecules participating in the central dogma, DNA, RNA, and proteins, RNA probably has the most diverse set of functions of any of them. In this talk, I will give some background about the different types of RNA, discuss the structures and functions of the various RNAs, and then give an example of gene expression in a prokaryotic system. Now, RNA, of course, is made from DNA in the process of transcription, and the copy of DNA makes, is made into RNA using the nucleotides U, G, C, and A. RNA is processed by various enzymes known as RNases, and RNA can also be completely broken down by various other RNases, so it's a relatively unstable molecule to work with. Some viruses, like HIV or measles and flu virus, actually use RNA as their genetic material and not DNA. So the role of RNA in the central dogma is central to the central dogma. Now, the central dogma, of course, says that DNA copies itself, DNA makes RNA, and RNA can, in some cases, go back to DNA by reverse transcriptase, as we have seen. But more importantly, RNA goes and makes protein, and that protein is essential, as we've seen, for all living cells.